what, what the lady's is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Donald Trump, your president, is in excellent health according to his White House physician following his physical on Friday but it's unclear whether any mental tests were conducted despite urging from mental health professionals. His doctor received a letter from dozens of doctors and health professionals urging him to conduct basic mental health tests on Donald Trump, who is 71 years old. Here's the letter. Without performing an evaluation of this kind, President Trump would be receiving care that is inadequate to the standard care regularly administered to millions of Americans covered by Medicare. Equally important, without this evaluation, the American people will not have a clear understanding about the health and well-being of Trump, which is essential for Americans to know of any president. Now, I think we all know the answer to why the White House don't want to conduct a mental health examination. Do cuckoo. It's real simple. Off top, the doctor can't be trusted. Who in the hell does he think we are? What was his name? Ronald McDonald? Gotta be. Ain't no way dude is 60, 70 pounds overweight. Drink Coca-Cola all day sit around, watch TV, don't do any exercise, eat pizza, cheeseburgers, all kind of stuff. I heard he even drinks lard. Ain't no way that dude healthy. The doctor had to be threatened. Straight up line, you can't trust nothing come out of that White House. I mean nothing. You can't trust nothing. Ain't no damn way dude is healthy. I can hear the Trump supporters right now. Well, of course Trump passed the health examination. I mean, he's the healthiest person to ever walk the earth. He's Donald Trump. I mean, he could do no wrong. You know, that guy could fly if he wanted to. He's Donald Trump and I love him so much. I want to have sex with him. And I'm talking about the women and the men talk like that. <laughs> Yeah, the doctor had to be threatened. Dude is cuckoo. I think that is very important to conduct some type of mental health evaluation immediately before this dude destroys civilization as we know it. He is gone. I don't know what drives him. Well, I guess I do. It's power. That's what drives him, power, stretching his authority, which is something he's always done, but he's never been put under the microscope the way he has since becoming president. The reason doctors want Trump's head examined is because some of the problems these experts say they have observed include rambling episodes of slurred speech, lying uncontrollably, frequent repetition of the same concepts, decreased motor coordination, and markedly declining vocabulary with over-reliance on superlatives. It would be in the American people's best interest to know the mental health of any president who shows severe signs of dementia and psychoticism. So why won't the White House allow the test? Because the Trump administration is full of a bunch of spineless racist cowards with precisely zero integrity. I think Trump needs more probing. Hey doc, next time try three fingers. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?